The Kanto Power Boxes are on absolute fire right now and are two of the most highly sought after products currently on the market. And today, we're gonna open up two of them. Howdy ladies and gents, my name is Troy and I open up Pokemon cards. So if that interests you, make sure you hit that subscribe button or because you like this face, also hit that subscribe button. Also hit that notification bell because you never know whenever I'm going to drop a new video and it may be time sensitive trying to help you cop things like Kanto Power Boxes. There are two versions of the Kanto Power Collection. One of them is the Mewtwo and Slowbro EX box which comes with a jumbo sized Mewtwo EX and 10 packs. The other one is the Dragonite EX box with Dragonite EX and a Pidgeot GX along with the Dragonite EX full art promo card and that comes with 10 packs just as well as the other one. But without further ado, let's jump straight into it. So initially the Mewtwo box was my favorite box uh, because it looked sick and it's more sought after, so slightly more sought after than the uh, Dragonite one. But if you look at this Dragonite card, it's just absolutely gorgeous. Even the Pidgeot card, they're just really, really gorgeous cards. So I think this one now takes the cake. I think I like the Dragonite one more. But we'll go ahead and open up this one first and see what we can get. I'm so excited about this video today. I've been wanting to open this, these up for so long. I was finally able to get my hands on some at Walmart. Um, and yeah, I bought them up. It was a little bit of a price increase because for some reason these started out as $40 whenever they initially released uh, at the end of last year. And Walmart doing Walmart things decided we're going to price them at $50, which... I mean, 10 packs, 50 bucks, 5 bucks a pack is good. That's how most uh, products are. Here is the Dragonite EX card, looking gorgeous. And here is the Pidgeot EX card, another gorgeous one. And a fun fact, these actually are not promo cards. They come like a promo card would. However, okay, well, this giant Jumba Wumba is a promo card. Um, but the other two are actually... Uh, cards that you find in the set that you can pull we could pull more of them right now today uh, You know what we'll put that off to the side So I actually didn't know that I recently found that out and here we go Evolutions has been on absolute fire uh, It's the 20th anniversary set it released five years ago, and it's a reprint of the sort of a reprint of the base set and at first, nobody wanted it. Everybody called Evolutions absolute trash. Like, everybody dreaded Rev uh, Evolutions. But now, you know, the Logan Paul video blew up and everybody wanted to open up base set. And this is the closest thing you're going to get to base set. Also, card trick is three, not four. You're going to ruin the surprise if you do that. And so again, this is the closest you get to ba uh, base set. And with me being newer into getting back into Pokemon, it's amazing because this these are the cards that I remember opening as a kid. I don't know what happened to them. I had a ton. I can't remember specific ones that I did or did not have. Okay, there we go. Nido King Break. Haven't pulled one of those yet. And we still have one more Arcanine. All right, we'll put the break back there. And so, yeah, I want to open up this set more i haven't been able to open up much because it's i believe towards the end of its life cycle and along with that it blew up because everybody wants to open it so the fact that i was able to get these and i'm about to open 20 packs right now is insane i really 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 want to get those charizards just like everyone else of course i would like the reverse hollow and the hollow but the hollow is obviously what I'm after the most. If you didn't know, it is a direct reprint, Pikachu looking gorgeous, a direct reprint of the OG base set one that's going for like half a mil now. Um, and it's looking amazing. Reverse Hollow Starmie and Pidgeot GX. There you go. Uh, just like I said, this is an actual card that can be pulled and we pulled it in the same one. Uh, sure, don't mind doubling up. That's a really nice card. Um, so the as far as value goes, a lot of these cards don't have too much. This isn't going to be as profitable. I ruined the surprise. I don't know why it was like that. Um, are not going to be as profitable of a set to open. However, the uh, the Hollow Charizard is going absolutely insane, 
and is worth thousands of dollars if you can get it at a PSA 10, which is almost impossible because I guess they had a lot of problems uh, in printing with these. Reverse Hollow Machoke and <sighs> Electrode. And also, you know, it's just a, a set that was printed more. And so I guess the quality is kind of, it's extremely hard to pull that, uh, to pull it in the first place, much less get it graded at PSA 10. It's a huge drop off from PSA 9 to PSA 10. Um, so yeah, you really, that's what you're going for is that PSA 10. I mean, just like everything, of course. Uh, whatever it would be, even if I got it, I would get it graded. I see something shiny back there. Poliwhirl, Poliwag, Nidoran, Onyx, Growlithe, Machop, Hollow Energy, Water Energy, and Mewtwo EX Full Art Gold. That is a gorgeous card. Look at the texture on there. Beautiful, beautiful. Mewtwo is also one of my favorite Pokemon. I'm pretty basic. I'm pretty basic when it comes to favorite Pokemon. Uh, my favorite is Charizard. Big surprise. Uh, but I also like most of the other commonly liked Pokemon, I guess. Um, why? I mean, I feel like everybody likes them for a reason. So if you have not, if you are trying to open up some Pokemon cards to feel nostalgic, this is as nostalgic as it's going to get uh, for, you know, your price. And I would definitely recommend it. They are a little bit more expensive. I would stay away from single packs, Reverse Hollow Voltorb, and Dugong. I would stay away from buying singles just because the single packs can be weighed. Because obviously we have something like this. It weighs slightly more than if you just have, you know, a normal rare card. So oftentimes whenever people have singles, they can weigh them and, you know, sell the packs that aren't so heavy and keep the nice packs. So I would definitely try to buy sealed product when it comes to this. Um, and yeah, I would stay away from the... Uh, entire 36 pack sets just because those are insane right now. I would recommend buying these. These are really, really good. Reverse Hollow Trainer and oh, that's all right. Full Art Gold Brock's Grits. There we go. I pull so many Brock's Grits in other sets that it's really nice to see it as a Full Art Trainer card. That's great. Oh man. Alright, so this is a great box as you're seeing. Uh, and that's why I would recommend it. It's going for uh, about double or triple the retail. But still, you get 10 packs. They're going to be in good condition because they're not crammed into a little tin. And you get those, uh, those promo cards. So definitely, if you want to open up some evolutions, if you want to feel the nostalgia... I would recommend going on eBay and grabbing some of these or StockX, anything like that, or looking on local Facebook Marketplace. That's going to be the cheapest way. Um, but yeah, you just do you. Uh, Hollow Energy and Dugong again. We still got three packs to go, and we've already pulled four hitters along with the, the two cards that come with the set. I'd love to get some OGs. I mean, of course... Like everybody, I want the Charizard, but even a Venusaur, Blastoise, I'll take them. I really wish they would have put Venusaur and Blastoise in the like the OG ones. Hey, Flying Pikachu, gorgeous card. Uh, just like they did the Charizard, that'd be absolutely sick. But sadly, they didn't. Don't know why. Kakuna and Electrode. They still have the 25th anniversary Pokemon set to be released. We've heard a few things about that, but nothing crazy. As far as the time recording this video, we haven't heard anything crazy. So we're not sure exactly what's going to be in there. But maybe um, they will have some more OG cards. That'd be sweet. Hopefully we can get some of the, the OG Blastoise and Venusaur in those to go along with these. But you never know. Haunter... Trainer, Kakuna, Voltorb, Diglett, Caterpie, Poliwag, Pikachu, looking great, Reverse Hollow, Tangela, and 
another Electro. That's like, what, three? Last pack of our first box with a little Raichu action. Ah! If you're not having a good time, I don't know what you're doing. This is a great set to be... Oh, ooh, forgot. Little spoiler. That means we're getting something good. If you didn't know, green code cards pretty much mean you got a hollow, and if you get a just an all-green code card, then that means you got nothing. Uh, which is why it sucks that they do that, because it kind of ruins it. But oh well. Also, if you're wondering, take redeem... Okay. Reverse hollow Missy's trainer, and... <sighs> Mewtwo EX. That's the exact same one that we're about to open that is in this seal product. Again, they're not promo cards. They're actual good cards that you want. Um, so, okay. We got that along with a double up of Pidgeot. Let's waste no time and get straight into the second box, the Mewtwo box. So, like I was saying, if you take these code cards that I'm giving out and you, take, you type in the um, code or scan the little thing... Then you go online to the Pokemon T uh, Pokemon website, and they give you a free pack of cards, virtual cards though that you would open up online, and you keep and you have just you know an online collection. Uh, seems super sick. It's the cheapest way to open up Pokemon cards. Just watch some, watch some videos, and uh, you're rewarded. At least on my channel, you will be because I'll be giving away all those code cards. Let me know if you do redeem one of those code cards and what you pull. Here are the two cards that come in here. you just seen this Mewtwo EX, and here's the Slowbro EX right there. Again, the, these cards are just gorgeous, and so that's why it really helps with the, with the price point of paying so much for these. Here is the Mewtwo EX Full Art. Okay. So it makes sense whenever you are paying more a premium on it, at least you're getting this stuff. Along with your 10 evolution packs. Green code card for you, that means you'll get something good, and there you go. Right there. You just go to Pokemon, and type in those, you get a free pack. Really let me know if you do redeem one of those though, because I have yet to redeem one. So let me know, how is it? Let me know if you pull anything sick, if you can get that Zard. Uh, you pull the exact same set that your openings. Um, so all the cards that I'm opening here, you can get from that online TCG. Okay, we've had some we've had some really good pulls. We haven't had exactly what I want, but that's okay because it can absolutely be worse. Hopefully, we can get a Zard though. I really want one of those because I'm obviously never going to get a base set. I'm obviously never going to get a base set Zard. So it'd be really nice to be able to get one of those just to, you know, come as close as possible to it. And I for sure I'd get it graded. Uh, Reverse Hollow Diglett and Farfetch'd. I have a couple cards I do need to get graded. I have the two Charizards from Champion's Path, and I pulled the Charizard from Hidden Fates. Finally, there's that. You can go check that out when I pulled it. Oh, man, that was a great day. I wasted so much money trying to get well it wasn't a waste it was fun um i wasted a lot of time and money to get that that was definitely the hardest one so i need to submit all of that plus some other cards uh to get graded but i've never done it i need to look it up and i'll make a video about that here is the reverse hollow nidorino and radicade uh, again i'll make a video whenever i do decide to actually get those graded i'll do one of those guess those grades where i show it and then I send it off to get graded and it comes back and we see what we think about it. Get a little grade reveal. And so that that should be fun. I'll be looking forward to that. But I believe the one of the grading services is still down. There's a couple grading services. Charmillion, which was my favorite Pokemon as a kid. There's a couple grading services, so I just need to do some research and see which one I want to go with. Uh, let me know in the comments if you've graded cards who you like the most and what you recommend. Re uh, hollow energy. And can we get our first really good pool? That's all right. There we go! Mega Charizard EX! The Pokemon Gods listen. 
We still got a Charizard. It's not the base set reprint, but it's still a great card to pull. One of the best cards you can pull. Look at that little Charizard up there, up at the top. Great card. There we go, baby. There we go. And we still got a ton of packs to go. All right. You see? I'm saying. It's, it's a really great set to open up. I don't know why people hated it so much whenever it first dropped. I guess, I don't know if it has too much of an impl implications on the actual TCG game, which I do not play. Um, but it is really fun opening up, you know, the base set. And who doesn't love Charizard? Trainer, Kakuna, Diglett, Seal, Nidoran, Ponyta, Doduo, Reverse Hollow Ponyta, and... That's all right. Oh, there we go! Yo! I was just talking about it! Dude! There we go! We got it! The Charizard! This is the chase card that you want! This is the base set reprint! Look at that! And we pulled it out of one of these boxes. These are one of the best chances you are at going to get at getting a 10 because it's not crunched in. Look at that beautiful card. Dude, let's go! I don't even know. It looks centered. From the best that I know, some people talk and they are talking. I don't see any scratches on there. Let's look at the centering on the back. Centering, I believe, is good. This looks like a great card. I don't really see any whitening on the edges. Dude. Let's go! Okay, I need to get a... I can't believe we just pulled that. I need to get something to put that in because, you know, I can't leave that out here free balling. Sorry guys, I had to reach for my top loaders and my sleeves. Don't want to scratch this bad boy up. Want to make sure I get it nice and neat in there. And in the top loader. Safe and sound. Come on, baby. Get it protected. Scooch it on in there. Come on. There we go. There. That's the pinnacle of this set right there. Look at that. And I was just talking about it. How insane. That's definitely going to get graded. Let's go. I've had some pretty good luck with these Zards. I finally have that one. Let's see if we can get the reverse holo Zard. That would be insane. Two in the same video. We already got the Mega Charizard. Oh, man. I think uh, the only Charizard now that I don't quite have that I'm chasing um, is the one in Shining Fate. So I guess that's what I need to move on to. Flying Pikachu looking gorgeous. <laughs> oh, my God. Guys, give me some fire emojis in the comments. Something something reverse hollow magikarp and star me it don't even matter i could rip the rest of these packs i don't even care let's go let me know if that's something you're interested in i don't know if i would ever actually want to rip uh pokemon packs because that's insane i've seen that uh from a lot of people who don't even open the pack they rip it they cut it, they literally cut it in half and destroy the cards. They'll fold them and then they'll open it to see, you know, what they destroyed. If that's something that interests you, let me know. Um, if there's a ton of interest, we'll see what happens. But, you know, we'll see. Reverse Hollow Machoke and Arcanine. I've seen that red. I've seen that red. You did too. We were, woo! I thought, I thought, I thought, but that's okay because, BOW! That bad boy's still sitting back there. It's whatever. It's whatever. Let's go. Ah, uh, let me know if you've had any luck with uh, evolutions, and also redeem these code cards. Like, look at these pulls I'm getting. I don't know if that has anything to do with the with the code cards. I don't think you get the exact same cards, but let me know if you can pull a Zard on the online game. Trainer Charizard Spirit Link. Hey, there's two Charizards. Let's get another Metapod Drowsy Caterpie Ghastly Diglett. Charmander, Hollow Trainer. I think I see. Ooh, there's something shiny back there. That's all right. There we go, Mega Blastoise EX. 
There we go! Guys, I'm gonna have to open up more of these. I'm going to have to happen. Blah, blah, blah. I'm gonna have to open more of these freaking Kanto power boxes. I got a few more. Let me know in the comments if, if you want to see me open up some more. Because I absolutely will. Let's put them right there by Charizard. Okay. <laughs> guys, guys, we got three packs left. Let's see if we can top it off with a Venusaur or the Reverse Hollow Charizard. That would be insane. Okay. Calm down, Troy. Relax. Dang it! Why do they keep switching that up? Spoiler alert. We don't get nothing in this pack, but hey, who cares? We'll speed through it. Trainer. Trainer. Poliwhirl. Magnite. Caterpie. Rata. Charmander. Ghastly. Energy. And... Arcanine. Alright. Hopefully these ones won't get ruined. Two more packs. Thank you guys so much for watching. It means a lot. It would also mean a lot if you could hit that like button for me. Um, and yeah, subscribe if you like what you've seen. There we go. Okay, sorry. Didn't want to spoil it. And let me know what you think in the comments of this video. Uh, my setup. What can I improve? What would you like to see? And yeah, just anything you want. I'll try my best to reply to all two of you. All two comments that I get. Reverse Hollow Machop and Mewtwo. There we go. It's not a, a hollow or anything, but that's still a beautiful card. And that's, you know, it's from base set. So I, I'm still super stoked that I got that. Man, I, I, oh, I wish so much that I could find. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Don't cover up Charizard Mewtwo. You're cool, but you ain't that cool. Alright, chill. Daddy, daddy, chill. Anyways, I wish I could find my OG cards. I had so many. I had books and books because my dad would always open up uh, sports cards. I wasn't into it, so I would open up Pokemon cards. So anytime he had to go buy sports, I would have to go and get some Pokemon cards one, two, three. But I've looked everywhere. They're gone. I don't know what happened to them. Someone ate them for sure. All right. Last pack. Give me some fire emojis or some leaf emojis. Whatever you want me to pull. If you want me to finish it off and get that reverse hollow charge on, I keep looking at it and it reminds me. Or if you want me to get that Venus or leave some uh, leaves. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. This has been an extremely fun video. Thanks for the support. I appreciate it. Let's see what we're going to end on. Make sure you go check out my other videos. It has some Hidden Fates, Shining Fates, the Chilling Rain newest set, Vivid Voltage, you name it, I got it. Um, Fire, Reverse Hollow Magmar, is that a sign? Let's see. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. We're ending on... Oh, Beedrill! I would say you ruined it, but that's not possible when you got this bad boy. Thank you guys so much for watching. Till next time, peace!